Check it out, guys. The deep freeze is over. <laughs> Beautiful day today. It's minus one right now. Or 30 Fahrenheit. That's not bad. We had such a brutal, brutal weather pattern. It's been four weeks since the birds have come out. So we're celebrating. The cold snap is done. <laughs> Let's go in and see the birds. Yeah, guys, the deep freeze is over. <laughs> birds can finally come outside. Look at that, taking a snow bath. And it's supposed to get even better in the next few days. We won't put no water in today. Yeah, we're all so happy that the deep freeze is over. It was brutal. It's been four weeks since the birds have been in the Avery, imagine? We couldn't make any videos of them out here, and we weren't going to put them out just to make a video, right? Like some days were 30 below. Some evenings, uh, minus 33. Like you can't even think of, you don't even want to go out yourself. And Kulika and I still managed to do some chores. And the pup always does her business outside. There, <laughs> there's no dog litter boxes, not for cats. <laughs> But she runs out quick and does her business and comes right back in, so it's not a problem. Like she, you gotta do what you gotta do, right? But yeah, we're really happy that it's like this, and we hear it's even gonna get nicer. Like one of the days coming up, plus six, that's over 40 Fahrenheit, so what a contrast, right? What a difference. So thought I'm gonna take advantage, make a video. It's it's the deep freeze is over video. Yeah, the deep freeze is over video. <laughs> That'll be the name of the video. Deep freeze is over. <laughs> yeah. Some of you watching are probably saying, it still looks too cold to me. <laughs> well, if you're not used to the climate, yeah, but we're, we're celebrating up here, we're happy. And like I said, we were doing chores in the bad weather because we needed to round up firewood and stuff like that. And I'll leave a link to the other channel below. Our Dream Homestead channel, you can see the wood I've been doing and stuff. And actually, me and one of the neighbors the other day we cut down a bunch of trees. The trees were dead, so they're free for the taking. So that was pretty tiring. But the weather was nice at least, so that's worth it. The least we can do it in the weather wasn't bad. That cherry is vocal as usual. That's maple down there. This is pie up here and spices in the corner. Back to Peach's corner. Peach, hello Peach. Peach. <laughs> He's happy to be in the corner. Yeah. Oh, someone's saying good Peach. I think that was spice. It might have been that pie though. No, I, before pie was up here and, oh, they're switching. <laughs> It's like those cops, like the shell game, guys. You know, you put the something under the shell and you, you move them around. Oh, hello. What do you got to say? Nice weather, right? Good beach, yeah. <laughs> Bye. Oh, you took off. Having fun. What's that, Cherry? So they'll be out for a little while today. They got to, you know, they get some more exercise here. They can fly around and stuff, move around more. Some nice fresh air. So they really need that too. But we weren't going to take them out in that really brutal weather, right? So we have to wait. We have to wait for the deep freeze to end. And some of you saw the last video about the predator, the hawk, and the, and the owl. This enclosure is safe. It's 100% safe. The, the wire is strong. And when we seen some swooping, like last summer and stuff the bir the birds go to the to the ground but n nothing can grab them from the top anyways the perches are are low enough but they immediately drop to the ground and nothing can open the door here this is really secure actually we just want to build a nice wooden one and give a roof so they can be out in the rain and stuff like that but this is plenty strong yet. It, we even put little Sunny Boy in here, our cat, sometimes because when the birds are in the house and we, we bring him out, he wants to go out so bad and we want to protect him too from, from hawks and owls. So he's coming here too. It, it's very secure in this, this outdoor Avery. That's Peach in the snow. 
He's having a snow bath. <laughs> Talking in the corner. Yeah, we love it up here, guys. You know, some people say, move out of there. How can you live in the brutal? But it was cold everywhere in Western Canada and a lot of the states I heard was cold even. Like a lot of people got snow and cold. It was going quite far south. And maybe some of you watching now still have cold weather. I don't know, but... And it will return. We're going to get cold weather again. It's not... Winter's far from over here. But hopefully we don't get such a long stretch. Like four weeks the birds didn't go out. And they're happy to be inside. They're content. If they came out here for a minute, they, they'd say, get me back in there. What are you doing? They wouldn't want to be out here. So, because, you know, they're not acclimatized to it. So, you know, they're happy. They didn't show any signs of, like, you'd see depression or something. Like, there's just, they're happy birds and talk, talking going on. Even Cherry, vocal as he is, doing his thing and eating and resting and just, just taking it easy. And now the reward is, look where they are, they're outside again, so... But this whole, this whole week coming up, they're going to get outside now every day. Because it's only going to get warmer from here. So we're going to enjoy this weather for the next week or so. And then when it gets colder again, hopefully it's not as long as a cold, cold, cold stretch. But you just never know, right? But, you know, maybe a few days and then you get a nice mild day. And go, they can go back out. So, but winter is not over. Not up here anyways. Hello, Peach. I hear a raven. There's a raven behind me. I can hear his wings flapping. He's not coming in here. He just, he probably was just taking a look from a distance. The raven's never shown any aggression to our birds. There's sometimes I can see someone looking from a high up or they fly over high up. But there's no swooping down from ravens. <laughs> Thanks for all your nice comments, guys. We appreciate that. And for the people that bought gifts from the wish list, again, thank you. I hear a raven. You're responding to that raven now. I mean, spice, I mean, pie is talking. He said peach. <laughs> They're kind of looking up. I don't see nothing. Oh, a couple of ravens going over the house. I can't show you because the the sun. You wouldn't you wouldn't have seen them if I would have pointed the camera there. Two ravens went by high up, and the birds were looking up. They saw them going. Beach you, yeah. <laughs> Hello, Peach. Beach, yeah. Peach enjoying the nice weather. You're gonna be out and you're gonna enjoy it now this week, Peach. So thanks for watching and give a big thumbs up if you enjoyed this. The deep freeze is over and the birds get to come out and have some fun in the Avery. See you in the next one, guys.